It's really unfortunate that we started hearing some disturbing news from some LGAs of invasion of council secretaries. River State Governor Sim Fubara addressing the media at the end of the State Security Council meeting. The meeting was convened following reports of disturbances in some local government areas where youths were said to have invaded some council secretariats. The development comes a day after the expiration of the three-year tenure of elected local government chairmen, vice chairmen and councillors in the 23 local government areas of the state. The governor had in a statewide broadcast early on Tuesday directed the heads of local government administration to take charge of the councils until further directives are given. But the chairman whose tenure constitutionally expired on Monday, June 17, are hell-bent on staying longer in office. They claim that there is a law that permits them to do so. That controversial law was passed by the Martins Ameule led 27 lawmakers loyal to the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory. But the High Court in River State has nullified the tenure extension for the local government chairman, with the court ruling that the new law is inconsistent with the 1999 Constitution and Section 9, Subsection 1 of the River State Law No. 5 of 2018, which fixed the tenure of local government chairman at three years. The law has said that there is no extension of tenure. Court said so. And whoever is assuring anybody anywhere of whatever, I advise them to desist from it because peace is what we need in these states. Governor Sim Fubara says he's aware of a plot to destabilize the state. Our enemy is also planning a lot of things, but we will not fall into that plot where we will allow him or them to destroy the peace that we're enjoying in the states. I am also aware that there is also a grand plan to come and arrest some of our supporters. This time around, you have to pass through me to arrest them. Because I don't think there is anything that any of those people following us have done, rather than stand on the side of truth. If it will cost us our life to stand on the part of truth, we will do that. And I will be the one that will lead this cause. He says he will do whatever it takes to maintain peace, law and order in River State. I assure every one of you, and whatever it takes to make sure that we maintain peace and order, we are not going back with that. The River State Governor is also calling on the people of the state to shun all acts of violence and go about their lawful business peacefully. E. Dagbo Abiyakame, AIT News Patakat.